Well, internet. Wow, that was enthusiastic. Um, hey, so today I keep bumping the count, the thing. Sorry about that. Starting over. Hey there, internet. Today may very well be the last time you will ever see this room. Gas. Life. Unedited. So yeah, it is officially the second to last Friday of my entire sophomore year of college. I do have one more week of finals-y type stuff next week, but I'm actually done with finals on Wednesday. And so there's a fairly good chance that I will probably be leaving here Thursday or very early Friday, which means, depending on when I make the video, because sometimes I make it like Wednesday and sometimes I make it like Friday at 6.30 in the evening because I'm very inconsistent like that. This is probably the last time you will ever see a vloggity thing from within this area because even when I come back to school next year, I'm gonna be living in a completely different dorm not even the same building and it will probably look nothing like this so yeah that's kind of sad but i have realized that i spend far too much of my time on this thing talking about the ends of things and i have decided i am going to talk about some beginnings because it's about time i actually did something slightly optimistic Yay! Because I've been thinking through this whole end of school thing and end of people leaving, that doesn't make any sense, but people leaving and how I'm probably going to be super sad about it, but I realized I'm completely forgetting the fact that summer is beginning, and while I don't like summer, I've talked about that, there are still people and opportunities and things and stuff and other things and stuff that are going to be happening that I don't normally get to do during college, so it's not really like something's ending, it's more just something's changing, and who knows, this summer could be like the very best three months of my entire life. I mean, that's probably not all that likely. I like to hope that maybe I have some wonderfulness type stuff to look forward to, but still, the summer has just as much to offer me intrinsically as like a college semester does. It's, there's not really any difference between the times, aside from one as like academia and the other's like other stuff. I don't know. I mean, as it stands now, it looks like I'm going to be having like at least two-ish type jobs, maybe even three, depending on what different things I end up taking on into my schedule. And I'm going to be pretty busy and it's going to be hard, but it's going to be fun and it's going to press me a lot. And I'm going to get to do all kinds of fun meetings type things. I might even be buying like a whole new computer and a whole new like real DSLR camera and like editing Adobe After Effects type stuff so my vlogs could be super awesome from here on out. I mean they're probably not really going to change that much so they won't be all that more awesome but they will at least look more awesome so that's a plus. But yeah that's kind of what my summer's looking like but beyond that just thinking about beginnings in general I've realized how much of my life I've missed out on by obsessing over endings and how much thought I put into it. I mean my whole life I've kind of always been reticent to make new friends and that kind of thing and push myself into like new groups of people because I've always thought you know they're gonna be gone someday I'm not gonna be friends with them anymore and it's not really worth getting invested if I'm just gonna have that all ripped away at some point but these past three weeks I've actually started getting involved with some of the people that I've known for the entire school year because like at my college we have this brother dorm and sister dorm type thing and so there are all these people that I should have been friends with but I've kind of completely ignored them and I kind of feel like a jerk about it so if you're watching this I apologize to all of you people for just kind of ignoring you for nine months. But in these past three weeks that I've actually started interacting with them, I've realized how much I have missed out. And in being selfish and so focused on my own little like nucleus of stuff and things, I've in reality deprived myself of so many wonderful encounters and experiences and funny people and wonderful people and cool people. I mean, cool being a very arbitrary term and probably not the kind of people you would think are cool. But you know, I tend to think they're pretty awesome. And I've actually gone and played basketball like in just, just mm, stutter but like I've actually gone and played basketball in the gym just hanging out with these people a couple times which is kind of funny because if you know anything about me I'm absolutely terrible at basketball I just can't do any of it the dribble the run the shoot blah no bad and yesterday I went out and threw a football with them which I apparently can actually kind of do although the catching thing kind of hit or miss so you know still working on that but yeah I've just kind of realized that life in general is full of opportunities for beginnings and when we spend our lives thinking about what's ending and what we have to do and get done and I kind of talked about this in a video a long time ago called deadlines that was kind of a terrible video but when we focus on these things we miss so many other things that we can do and it's just really stupid my voice went really high there it was weird so yeah I don't really want to ramble anymore because I realize I probably already wasted like four and a half minutes of your time I never know how long these videos are gonna be when I'm filming them because I just have a little timer that says how much raw footage I have and I never know what that's gonna be when I cut it down but yeah I would challenge you to live and that's maybe kind of stupid thing to say, but just look for those places in your life that normally you'd be like, oh, it's not worth it, and just go do it, and do something this week. If you're ending your college year-ish type thing, good luck on your finals and all that. Have a wonderful summer. If I never see you people again, I love your beautiful faces, or at least this little webcam, because that's what you look like. Until next week, deuces.